Remember to Look Up to See the Big Picture. That's the title of my first kind of uh, session for you today. <laughs> and yesterday we went to Laurie Lee Country, if anyone uh, knows the author, of course, Cider with Rosie, fantastic book. And it's all about the Slad Valley in Stroud. And uh, we had a beautiful walk. We did about nine miles, actually. I'm preparing for, my, in a month's time, I'm off to France to walk the Western Front Way, the Path of Peace. So I'm, I'm going to do about 100 miles on that one to, to start with. But anyway, got to get into practice. So we took some photographs. I'll show you some photographs, first of all, for you. So let's share with you some photographs of the scene. There's me doing my thing. So let's let's bring me into the scene as well so you can see both. So yeah, let's put us both in there. There's me. So as you can see, it's a beautiful valley. And uh, there's Shelley as well, looking great. And everyone's happy with the sunshine and all is good. But um, the problem we had is the map. Now, I'm, I'm quite happy with maps. And as you can see, there's a, a photograph of the Ordnance Survey map. Now, that's a screenshot of the app which I use, I use a phone now, an Ordnance Survey phone map. I, you know, you subscribe to it and you get to be able to, you know, walk around using your phone as opposed to the paper. But the great thing about the phone map is it gives you like a GPS signal so you can see exactly where you are, which is great if it's like a normal walk, but this one was really complex. To zoom in for you so you can see, this is part of the uh, the Slad Valley and we were walking um, along, along the stream there. It was quite easy, but when we got here, boy, did it get really confusing because there's like, it's like the spaghetti junction of footpaths <laughs> around there. <laughs> and we were all over the place. And the problem I had is because the sun was shining and I was looking at the phone and it's difficult to look at the phone when the sun's shining because it like glares at you. So I was I was like this, like all the way. We were walking like this. I said, hold on, oh, we've got to turn left here. Now we've got to turn right. Let's go around here and all sorts of things. And at one point, Shelley said to me, she said, stop. She said, Paul, you're not enjoying the view. You're not enjoying the, the sunshine and, and the valley because it was absolutely absolutely beautiful i mean who could who could mirror that in uh, the cider with rosie uh, slad valley and that's the point you see because in business uh, as a mortgage broker as a financial advisor whatever is your role then sometimes we get bogged down with you know looking down all the time we're looking we're down in the trenches we're trying to get busy we're trying to contact clients we're trying to drum up some business we're we're worrying about getting it wrong and not having any business because the market's still we're looking down all the time and worrying etc as i was doing with the maps and Shelley said, look, you know, look up, just enjoy what you've got. And that's the message, really. Occasionally, look up beyond the, uh, the detail so you can see the big picture. You can see the, uh, the vision that you set yourself a few years ago when you became a mortgage advisor. Why do you do what you do? You know, the bigger picture, the strategic stuff, you know, which often is much more motivational than down in the trenches. So, um, yeah, that's, that's the message, really. And uh, we had a great time, as you can see from the picture. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Can't beat that. The only problem was that the footpath or, or the path that we took, because the Ordnance Survey map people, they give you, like, recommended routes. Other people have done, so you follow their routes, you see. It took us around the village of Slad. And Laurie Lee, the author's famous uh, or favourite um, bolt hole was this thing called the wall pack in and we missed it we actually diverted around it so never got to the wall pack in which is a bit of a shame but uh, such is life and you have to get used to such things don't you 